A dedicated athlete turning her three-time battle with breast cancer into a call to action for survivors and thrivers everywhere. Running for more than two decades now, and it's not done yet. I'm a three-time breast cancer survivor. I was originally diagnosed at 33, 35, and 37. I'm 59 years old, and I am still running. I have run 160 races around the country, all benefiting breast cancer. When I was diagnosed with breast cancer, I wanted to do something positive, and I wanted to get the message out to young women to be an advocate for your own health. I've run with over 2.5 million participants and over 300,000 breast cancer survivors, and it's just incredible. I was diagnosed originally in 1997. I had a nine-month-old baby. I had been nursing him when I realized there was a big lump in my armpit. So I went to the doctor and he had prescribed antibiotics. He informed me that I had a breast infection and that's what led to the lump. And they said, no, you're young, you're healthy. There's no reason to even do a mammogram at 33. So I took the antibiotics and the lump did not go away. So I went to my obstetrician and he ordered the mammogram and I actually had a diagnosis of stage two breast cancer. That we may find a cure so that our daughters and granddaughters won't have to worry about the disease they once called breast cancer. I started running to help with the education and awareness on a national level, but also wanted to do something on a local level. So my husband and I started the Pink Ribbon Breast Cancer Fund, and part of our mission is to give scholarships and help these families that have had this cancer experience. My mom was first diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma disease when I was 13. She relapsed a second time when I was in high school. I received a scholarship back in 2010 from Judy's Scholarship Fund and that helped me to attend UC Santa Barbara. And now the coolest part is that now I'm also an educator and a teacher alongside Judy at the same school. Cancer has taught me that life is short, life is precious. There's a lot of things that I have done in my life because of my cancer. I would never wish it upon anybody, but life happens and you just have to take it by the horns and make the best of it every single day. What an inspiration. Love that story. Thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.